YouTubers. What I thought I'd do in this video is uh, kind of give my impressions of the uh, High Uni uh, art set. Um, it's 22 degrees of uh, drawing pencils from Mitsubishi. And uh, I just got this set. It's brand new. And um, I haven't even started uh, sharpening the pencils yet. And as a matter of fact, let me see if I can do this with one hand here because I'm currently holding the camera with my other, which is something I don't normally do. So let's see. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and freeze this because I can't do this with one hand. So I'll be right back. Okay, and I got the box open right now. This is a really cool pencil tin. I really like it. And uh, you just kind of press on the two corners here and it pops open. But still, you probably want to use both hands. And then it comes with this little sheet which kind of gives you the uh, gradient um, you can see f from dark to light and a really nice set here it goes all the way from it looks like uh, 10B to 10H that's about the most range you're going to get in any pencil set and I'm really looking forward to the darker end to see how they stack up against my uh, Lumograph Mars 100 from Stadler which is what I use because I really like their dark pencils it looks like they have a little bit of carbon mixed with their graphite with the Stadler so um, we'll see how these um, Mitsubishi unis work now how I'm going to review this is I'm actually going to use these to draw my next portrait okay and uh, I thought I'd go ahead and draw uh, Mr. James Bond number I don't know, four, uh, Pierce Brosnan. And so uh, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to draw him, not, not on this video, but you will see the, the final product when I'm done drawing because it takes me a couple of weeks or so. Uh, I take my time. And I'm going to use uh, these pencils, and then uh, I'll talk about uh, my impressions on using them for drawing uh, the portrait. And I'll see you in few, to you it's a few seconds, for me it's a couple of weeks. Bye. Okay, I finished my pencil drawing and that's it right there. Pierce Brosnan, James Bond, and um, for the graphite I used the uh, new, um, or new, new for me that is, the 22 degrees uh, Mitsubishi High Uni Select, or Art Set I should say, not Select, wouldn't be a bad name for it though. Anyway, um, so let me kind of give you a real quickie on this uh, thing here. Now, I, I didn't just use these pencils exclusively because... Um, if you'll notice from the picture here that there are a lot of dark blacks here. And while this pencil kit would have achieved that pretty much with this 10B here, 10, 9, 8. I mean, you got a lot of dark pencils here. These would have left a graphic, a graphite shine, um, which is not good when you're tilting the picture in the light it, it will really take away from the contrast of the picture so what I did was I used a General's 9XXB pencil for the blacks and then I went ahead and used as many of these as I could um, for everything else in the picture the hand, the nose, mouth, ears anything that isn't just flat out white or black Okay, um, now here's the thing, uh, they went on really nice, smooth, um, nothing really stood out as what I would consider superior to, let's say, the um, Mars Lumograph Statler pencils that I currently use. Well, actually I use quite a different, I, I have Blix. Uh, which you see here are Blicks. My Statlers are here. And here's 
Here's the Stettlers that I, I really enjoy using, mostly because if you'll see here in my pencil stack, here is the 8B, and this 8B would produce those blacks without the shine, um, just like the general 9XXB, though the 9 is actually darker than the 8, though it may be hard to notice. And um, that's what I like about the Stadlers is that it's softest pencil, the, B, the 8B in, in this small little thing here, um, is darker without the shine. And you're not going to get that, of course, with this or with any of these other pencil sets, which just use straight graphite. Um, I'm using the Blix here for some of my drawings because it was the first ones I ever had, and um, i got to use them up. I don't want to waste stuff. For the most part, drawing pencils, um, they're all pretty good. Okay, I mean, here I have the uh, Favorite Castell 9000, and um, I had actually done a review on this not too long ago. But uh, it's, just, it's just drawing pencils. Nothing stands out except I like the, the Stadler Mars Lumograph 100 the best. Now, with that said, the pencil leads were, the shades were great from one degree to the next. Here's what I don't like about this, okay? I don't want a kit with 22 degrees. I mean, what in the world? When you want to draw something dark, you've got to pick between a 10, 9, 8, or 7. I mean, are you kidding me? I mean, if you're going to even tell the difference. And all these hard pencils on the other end, this 10H, 9H, 8H, 7H. I mean, what's the point? You're, you're really not going to see much on the paper. You can use a 6H and just have a light touch to achieve this. So there are a lot of pencils in here that I don't think is necessary. And too many choices is not necessarily a good thing. And it's nicer, I think, to just have the basic pencils um, for drawing. You know, like maybe go from a 4H for your hard. Just go hard as 4H. And then on the other end of the spectrum, you know, you'd go from HB to 2B, 4B, 6B, and then pick, pick whatever one you want for your darkest pencil. I'll, I prefer the Stadler 8B pencil or the General's um, 9XXB. Now, if you're wondering why I haven't shown you the General, it's because I actually, I actually used it up until it was a little tiny stub to draw this, uh, all this black here. And then I put it aside to give it to my daughter who happens to like all the stubs of all my pencils. But anyway, um, I think it's, it's a lot of money for a pencil set. Because, for one thing, it's just too many pencils, okay? But as far as quality, it's very high quality. The softs are soft, the hards are hards, the in-betweens are in-betweens. It is a good, high-quality set. Um, but as far as myself here in the United States, I spend a lot less money going with another pencil set. And as far as the dark pencils, going with... Um, the 8B Stadler Mars or with a General 9XXB. Well, that's it for my um, review of the High Uni. It's a good high quality set. I think it's just a little bit overkill and because of that too, it, you're going to, I mean it's 30 bucks for a pencil set. I'd rather spend $12 um, for one of my other pencil sets and only get the main 8 pencils, 6, 8 pencils and, and a dark one. And that's all you need, really. So thanks again for watching. If you like this review, please give me a thumbs up. If you like my picture, give me a thumbs up. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.